Today we're going to turn your videos from looking like this into something that looks like this. Welcome back to another video and today is share ko sa inyo yung usual color grading na ginagamit ko sa lahat ng cinematic videos na ginagawa ko sa TikTok, Facebook at sa YouTube. Ito yung color grading na ginagamit ko when it comes to cinematography and for studio type videos. So these are the settings na kailangan mong walaman at pwede mo apply sa mga videos na gagawin mo. So without further ado, let's do this using your phone with CapCut. So now let's talk about my usual. So here's the setting. First is we need to import our clip to CapCut. At ang pinakaunang setting na ilalagay natin is yung filter. Select your main track and go to filters. And at this moment is kailangan nating gumamit ng filters from scenery. And then we will choose the golden atom. The reason why I usually use it because it enhances your skin tone. So in my case, I'm going to set the range up to 90%. Now let's dive into adjustment. Let's adjust the brightness first. Yung usual settings na ginagamit ko para dito is binababa ko yung range ng brightness para matakpan yung mga unnecessary noise. So we're going to set this up into negative 6. Next is contrast. This setting can help to reduce the haze of your video. So if wala masyadong haze sa video mo, pwede mo na to skip. But in my case, I have to increase the range up to 15%. At this time, hindi mo na natin gagalawin yung saturation. We're going to adjust that pagkatapos ng lahat ng settings. Next is the brilliance. This setting can help us to enhance the glow of our video. It also helps you to separate the subject from the background. But in my case, I'm going to adjust the range into negative 10. And next, we have the sharpness. This setting is optional. It's up to you kung idadagdag mo siya sa adjustments mo. But in my case, dadagdagan ko siya ng 10%. And now let's adjust the U, saturation, and the lightness. Set the saturation of red up to 25%. For the saturation of orange is 50. And last, adjust the saturation of yellow up to 37. Next is the graph. This time we need to form the S curve. Just follow this graph for color white. Nakakadulo itong graph para mabalance yung light na nasa video mo. Make sure to follow this graph because this is very important for your color grading. Now let's dive into highlight. Highlight helps you to increase the brightness of the light that is visible from the image of your video. In my case, I'm going to set the highlight up to 10%. Next is the shadow. This setting can help you to adjust the range of the shadow that is visible on your video. But in my case, I have to set this up up to 8%. Now let's adjust the temperature. I usually use this setting to enhance the skin tone. So I'm going to set this up up to 10%. Next is the overall hue. This part is optional but for me, I'm going to use this to enhance the overall look of my video. And it also helps me to enhance the skin tone shadow and the highlight and the overall color of your video in my case i want to bring this down into negative 10 so finally we're gonna go back for the saturation nakadepende na sa iyo kung gagalawin mo tong setting na to this setting is optional at this moment but for me i'm going to adjust the saturation up to 10 percent you can review your work kung meron bang idadagdag or babawasan. But for me, this is perfect. But always remember that this adjustment might not be suitable for your footages. Choose the right adjustment according to your video. But it's up to you kung gagamitin mo yung usual na color grading na ginagamit ko. Or you can explore more on CapCut. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And follow me on TikTok, Facebook, and Instagram. And see you on our next video. And let's create Beyond Limits.